Hey guys, welcome back to Captain Jasper. Today we're going to be talking about hides for rabbits. Do pet rabbits need a hide? Or why does a rabbit need a hide? Is something I often get asked. And the answer is, is because they're a prey species. In the wild, rabbits would have the safety of their warrens to dart into if they felt under threat. And pet rabbits still have the same instinctive drives within them, telling them to hide if when they perceive threats. Wild rabbits would have to worry about aerial and land predators which is why they prefer grazing in shrubbery and under trees. Pet rabbits still have this instinctive desire to stay protected in their environment and will display similar behaviours of hiding and taking cover. I find it best to have a hide with multiple exits and if you have more than one bunny it is recommended that you do. As with only one exit, if both bunnies are inside the hide and one is blocking the exit, it's actually been known to cause fights although I think this is very rare and very well bonded rabbits, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Having multiple exits and entrances will also mimic a rabbit's natural warren system, as will tunnels. Some hides we have include ones from cosy castles, which is great as it has more than one exit and entrance, and the option to extend it to a full bunny fort, which is something I'll definitely be doing in the future. Another place that we get a lot of the rabbit's hides and products from is animal adventure pods. This is where we got the boys' ship, where Jasper spends most of his time. They do some great products tailored specially for rabbits. Another place the boys like to hang out is under our footstool, which I think we got from Ikea. But anything with a similar design or a small table, well, bunnies seem to love to hang out under. Cardboard boxes also make great hides for rabbits, but they can also shred to pieces, making it a great enrichment item. Just be sure that your rabbit doesn't ingest any of the cardboard, as this can become impacted in their stomachs, causing GI stasis. If your rabbit does tend to ingest the cardboard, grass or hay, tunnels and hides can make great alternatives that are safe for bunnies to eat. They also typically last a bit longer than cardboard hides, especially against a rabbit on a shredding hype. Just be careful not to type in rabbit hides into Google, because if you do, some really disturbing images can come up. So make sure you put in rabbit hides and tunnels, because then Google seems to know what you're on about. Other places your rabbit may end up hanging out are under your bed, behind your couch, or generally in dark and small places as this mimics a wild rabbit's warren. I hope you guys like this quick video. In upcoming videos, we'll be talking about spring fever, bonding with your bunny, and tips on free roaming. So don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss a thing. 